everyone, welcome to my channel. Today we're doing a reading for sign of cancer. And keep in mind that this does not resonate for every cancer. If you like a personal reading, that's going to be the first link in the description down below. Repeat that first link in the description down below for a personal reading. Also find my Etsy shop, my shirt store, my website, different social media platforms I'm on. You can also find me on Patreon and Ko-Fi. Go support me on there. Go support me on Ko-Fi so we can reach the next level so we can move the deck. And if you'd like to make a donation, feel free to do so. I do appreciate your donations here. So, Cancer, let's see if Spirit has in store for yourself was a message for you and what is coming towards you. Okay, we have cards falling out. What do we have? We have the Spear Maiden. Okay. We have Tilsian. We have grill four with stone eight. Alright, I feel like there's something you're working on here. Maybe something spiritual, cancer. We have stone eight. Uh to listen. Okay. Tilisian is like the is it's telling me that you have a lot of spiritual knowledge and wisdom here. Okay? Maybe you'll even be telling the uh, next generation of this, the younger generation, uh, stories that you you know, like how you how your life has been. Alright, things that you've experienced, things that you know. Alright, but there's also questions that come out with these cards. Now let's pull a couple more cards first. So let's see. We have the Stone King. Alright. Can be yourself, and then we have the Grail Knight. So cancer, you're appearing as someone very stable. Now let's have a look at your cards for a second. See, so also come with questions with these cards. All right, but what's us in here? We have tradition, revelation, insight, inspiration, preserving heritage and ancient memory, initiation, advice or counsel, spiritual transformation. Questions. What inspires you about this? What is seeking to be revealed now? What is the next step in your story? So the question here is, what is going to be the next step in your story, Cancer? Spear. Spear Maiden. An energetic, enthusiastic, outgoing, courageous, and resourceful person. Encouragement. Illuminating news, loyalty. So that could be yourself or a person around you. Question, where must you be forthright? So where must you be forthright at, Cancer? Alright. Stone, rails. Rail four. The night. Four. Lethargy, boredom, spiritual stagnation, dissatisfaction, emotional immaturity. Question, what is causing dissatisfaction? So Cancer, the big, like, what is causing dissatisfaction as of right now? What's the next step in your story? Where must you be forthright at? Alright, there's something here you're bored with. Alright, maybe being truthful about what you're being bored with. The grail now. A meditative, receptive, visionary, charming, empathetic, romantic person. Idealism, emotional response. All right. So once again, this could be your per this could be your person. <laughs> this could be yourself or a person around you. Question: What vision inspires you? So, what are you dissatisfied with, and what vision inspires you? So, what are you inspired by right now? What vision of the future inspires you? Like, what motivates you? What's your dream? What's the next step of your story, Cancer? Are you wanting? Stone eight. Prudence, patient application, apprenticeship to a craft, better results through gaining professional skills, methodical work, detailed preparation. Question, what do you need to practice? It's asking, what do you need to practice? All right, Cancer, what do you need to perfect? Something in your work, something in your craft here. Stone king. Prosperous, dependable, wise, responsible individual. Love the land and nature. Question, what must be off campus? So, Cancer, when you do get what's the next step of your story, what, when you do get what you want here, what are you going to offer and thanks to it? Alright? 
Like, what is your offer when spirit gives you whatever you're wanting? Right? So, Cancer, that is a message for you. That's the questions for you to answer, kind of think about throughout the day. All right? Let's get some room to trust yourself. You have Mars. Mars is the planet of desire. Mars is the planet of passion. Mars is also, it rules Aries. You have these two dragon lovers, one being fire, the other one being water. So this tells me that your lover could have Aries placement somewhere in their chart. Or they're very passionate, they're very action-oriented. Alright, so we have this dragon, which uh, can represent the Chinese way saying. Of the dragon, dragon big power, strength, prosperity, good luck. And supernatural powers. We also have the rainbow on it, which can be that it promises. So, we have these two dragons, one being of the moon, the other one being of the sun. So, yeah. Heavy, like, your ruling planet is the moon, we have the sun, and we have Mars, all right, and we have the, the fire lover. So heavily that your your lover currently either is a fire sign, or in the future they will be a fire sign. We have Leo, we have Aries, and also be Sagittarius, but they have Leo, Aries heavily somewhere in their chart. We have the sun beetle, which you're connected to, connected with the sun, all right, it's healing rays. We have the sun god, Ra. We have Hathor. Got this Aztec serpent god that you're connecting to. Alright. We have a lot of... We have, we have something opening in itself. There's stillness here. But thing, there's things happening with inside yourself. Alright. Cancel. So, let's get the stone message. After this. Chords, which is love. Alright? So we're connecting with love. I do feel like there is love. You're in that love vibration, Cancer. You're in a loving vibration here. And I do feel like there's either love happening currently or about to happen. Or there's, some, there's something to do with love. And I feel like there's a lot of healing of love. You know what I'm saying? So, I'm just find this on my Etsy shop, uh, Cancer. It looks white in the camera, but it's, it's like a light pink. Um, that's all I have for you. Like I said, personal reading is going to be the first link in the description down below. You can also find my Etsy shop. Go in there, go buy something. I really appreciate that. And if you want to see me, oh, you can also find the extended down below in the comments. If you want to see more content, hit like, subscribe. Bye, guys.